All right. Well, while you're doing that, I'm going to show everybody how to be able to differentiate this as, as quickly as we can. Because obviously, we know that we would not want to go ahead and expand this to be able to get to that format, right? So what we're going to want to do is when we look at a problem like this, first thing, our normal integration rules. Always want to do that first. If it can be simplified, simplify and integrate, right? I mean, integration, basic integration uh, methods are simple enough. So if we can apply them, apply them. However, if we cannot apply them, which in this case, I do not want to expand this out, I want to look at u substitution. So basically, I want to say, do I have a u and a du dx? Well, I do have a function inside of another function. right? You could say I have this u here being raised to 10th power. And I just want to visualize, again, what I was telling you about, like kind of taking that derivative in your head. Is this giving me, if I take the derivative here, am I getting this derivative on the outside? Yes, yeah, so therefore, I know I can apply um, u substitution. So I'm just going to label everything out here again, just so we have it. u equals x to the fifth plus 5. I'm going to take the derivative of that, du dx, which is 5x to the fourth. And then basically what I'm going to do is, um, actually, I'll get, to, uh, I'll get to that in just a, a second. So if. Uh, integrating this. So what we can look at this as is integrating this is going to be uh, u to the 10th yeah and then du alright so what I can basically say is I can re-represent this as u to the 10th. And you guys can say here, this can then be represented. This is basically represented by 5x to the fourth dx, right? Now again, guys, remember, if, you, if this doesn't apply, we have to use some other integration technique. If this isn't the same, we can't use our u substitution. So that's why I just want to make sure you guys can see how my u to the 10th and my du are represented right there. Okay, Now we can just integrate, because we can integrate the integral from u to the 10th. right? It's not that bad. So now I integrate, and then I'm just going to plug my u back in. Thank you. 